Hello and welcome to the session on MDP ka here. Let's discuss a question which says integrate the following rational function 3x plus 5 upon x cube minus x square minus x plus 1. Now we know that it is always possible to write the integral as a sum of simple rational functions by a method called partial fraction decomposition. So if the form of the rational function is px square plus qx plus r upon x minus a whole square into x minus b then form of the partial fraction is a over x minus a plus b over x minus a whole square plus c over x minus b where a, b and c are real numbers to be determined So this is a key idea behind our question. We will take the help of this key idea to solve the above question. So let's start the solution. Now we have to integrate the rational function 3x plus 5 upon x cube minus x square minus x plus 1. Now it can be written in the form 3x plus 5 upon x plus 1 into x minus 1 whole square. Now, according to our key idea, or by using the form of partial fractions, we can write this is equal to a over x plus 1 plus b over x minus 1 plus c over x minus 1 whole square, where Real numbers A, B and C are to be determined suitably. So this gives plus 5 is equal to a into x minus 1 whole square plus b into x square minus 1 plus c into x plus 1. So 3x plus 5 is equal to a into x square minus 2x plus 1 plus b into x square minus 1 plus c into x plus 1. Again, 3x plus 5 is equal to ax square minus 2ax plus a plus bx square minus b plus cx plus c. On equating the 
the coefficients of x square, x and the constant term we get a plus b is equal to 0. Let us give this equation as number 1. Again, on equating the coefficient of x, we get minus 2a plus c is equal to 3. Let us give this equation as number 2. And on equating the constant term, we get a minus b plus c is equal to 5. Let us give this equation as number 3. Now, equation 1 implies b is equal to minus a. Now, on substituting b is equal to minus a in equation 3, we get a plus a plus c is equal to 5 or 2a plus c is equal to 5. Let us give this equation as number 4 on adding equation 2 and equation 4 we get now equation 2 was minus 2a plus c is equal to 3 and equation 4 was 2a plus c is equal to 5 This gives 2c is equal to 8. Therefore, c is equal to 4. On substituting, the value of c in equation 4, we get minus 2a plus 4 is equal to 3. This implies minus 2a is equal to 3 minus 4. Again, this implies minus 2a is equal to minus 1 or a is equal to 1 by 2. Now, B is equal to minus A implies B is equal to minus 1 by 2. Now, the integrand 3x plus 5 upon x cubed minus x square minus x plus 1 is equal to a over x plus 1. Now a is equal to 1 by 2. So this is equal to 1 by 2 into x plus 1 plus b over x minus 1. So minus 
1 by 2 into x minus 1 plus c upon x minus 1 whole square. Now c is equal to 4. So 4 upon x minus 1 whole square. Therefore, integral of 3x plus 5 upon x cube minus x square minus x plus 1 dx is equal to 1 by 2 into integral of 1 over x plus 1 dx minus 1 by 2 into integral of 1 over x minus 1 dx plus 4 into integral of 1 over x minus 1 whole square dx. Now, 1 by 2 into integral of 1 over x plus 1 dx is equal to 1 by 2 log of x plus 1. As the process of differentiation and integration are inverses of each other and derivative of log of x plus 1 is equal to 1 over x plus 1. So 1 by 2 into integral of 1 over x plus 1 dx is equal to 1 by 2 log of x plus 1. Similarly, 1 by 2 into integral of 1 over x minus 1 dx is equal to 1 by 2 log of x minus 1. Now we will solve this integral. So 4 into integral of 1 over x minus 1 whole square dx is equal to 4 into integral of. Now put x minus 1 is equal to t. Therefore dx is equal to dt. So, 4 into integral of 1 over x minus 1 whole square dx is equal to 4 into integral of dt upon t square. And this is equal to 4 into t raised to power minus 2 plus 1 upon minus 2 plus 1. And this is equal to minus 4 upon t. And this is equal to minus 4 over x minus 1. Therefore, integral of 3x plus 5 upon x cube minus x square minus x plus 1 dx is equal to 1 by 2 log of mod x plus 1 minus 1 by 2 log mod of x minus 1 minus 4 over x minus 1. One by two log of mod x plus one minus one by two log mod of x minus one minus four upon x minus one plus c now we know that log of m over n is equal to log m minus log n. So this is equal to 1 by 2 into log of mod x plus 1 over x minus 1 minus 4 over x minus 1 plus c. Hence the answer for the above question is 1 by 2 log mod of x plus 1 upon x minus 1 
minus 4 over x minus 1 plus c. I hope the solution is clear to you. Bye and take care.